What is going on everybody? Welcome back. This is Pete. <laughs> And I'm here to announce today that Pete is officially for sale. You can buy him for a dollar. What do you think about that? One buck? You can pre-order him right now. I'm hurting his feelings. I'm just kidding. Pete's not for sale. Oh, he's priceless. Before we get started, if you could do me a personal favor. Hey, do me a personal no, favor. No, I'm not. I'd really appreciate it. If you could please give this video a like, I and every other creator you watch would very much appreciate it. It not only helps me, but it also helps YouTube give you guys the content that you want to see. Kind of a win-win kind of a deal, am I right? Also, before we get started, definitely go back and check out my other recent videos. I've been posting a lot of news updates on Fright Night, Gremlins 3, NECA, Puppet Master figures. So definitely check those videos out as well. Whew. Now that we got that out of the way, let's get to the reason why you guys are all here. NECA, Victor Crowley clothed 8-inch action figure. That's a mouthful. That's what she said. So it was announced way back in February at the Toy Fair that NECA would in fact be dropping Victor Crowley figures. Kane Hodder portrayed Victor Crowley in the Hatchet franchise, one of my favorite franchise movies. And if you slept on Victor Crowley, maybe you saw the Hatchet movies and you hadn't seen Victor Crowley, I highly suggest checking this movie out. It's fantastic. A lot more on the comedy end of things, a little bit more low budget, but the gore um, effects in this movie are amazing. Check out Victor Crowley. It's super, super fun. So like I said, Said, way back in February it was announced that the figures would be dropping along with a handful of other figures and we got a little small image now we have full pictures of the figure and it looks awesome previewed at Toy Fair earlier this year NECA is bringing Adam Green's hatchet slasher Victor Crowley into their action figure family and we've got brand new images for you today folks coming soon Victor Crowley makes his action figure debut in NECA's retro style clothes figure line his gruesome head sculpt figures rooted hair and the axe wound left by his father. Standing at approximately eight inches tall, Victor Crowley wears his battered overalls made with real fabric and is equipped with a belt sander and double-sided hatchet accessories. The head sculpt, the paint, it looks awesome. It's got the blood splatter, it's got the real hair. Sometimes with the clothed action figures, they can look a little sketch if the clothes don't fit right or if they're not high quality, but NECA does a fantastic job with their clothed figures, so I cannot wait uh, to get my hands on this. Now, it is officially up for pre-order. I saw it uh, for pre-order on Toy Wiz, Big Bad Toy Store, a couple other places, so definitely check this out. Also, along with the regular clothed figure, it was announced that Victor Crowley is going to be a part of the Toonie Terrors line along with a couple of the other figures. I'll show you a little picture right here. Uh, so I thought I'd mention that as well. From what I saw, the clothes figure you could order and it'll ship January. The Toonie Terror, it'll ship in December. Sometimes those dates can be subject to change, but that's what it says for now. So guys, what do you think? I myself am so excited for these figures. I can't wait. If you want to get your hands on that, give it a pre-order now to get your Victor Crowley clothed figure. It looks badass. If you're into this type of video, definitely check out some of my other videos. I've been doing a lot of news updates lately because it's been a little slow on the new release side, obviously, as movies are kind of just in the shitter right now. If also, if you go back and you like this video, you like my other stuff, please consider subscribing. Join our quickly growing community. Guys, thank you so much for stopping by. Stay weird. And until next time, bye. I love movies. Gosh, I love movies. I love watching them, and I love making them.